Y'all know nothing about this. You need to pay attention. Sit back and relax. It's time for Goodall's Country Kitchen. All right, here in Gulf Shores, and we're at the original Oyster House. I guess anybody that's ever been to Gulf Shores more than a couple times has had to have gone to the original Oyster House. It's kind of a rite of passage for, uh, for tourists that come to Gulf Shores. This is probably the most uh, popular restaurant in Gulf Shores, and uh, it's also family owned. So you can come here and support local and get some of the best overall seafood in Gulf Shores. Also, before we go in to get our table, we're gonna go shop around, go to the different gift shops. They, uh, they, they own all those shops. That's all set up, so if you have to wait, you can have things to do and actually go shopping and spend more money before you go in and eat. So with that, let me go ahead and take you on a little tour around the place. As I said, if you end up on a big wait, uh, they got the boardwalk with all kinds of different shops to go in and, uh, you know, keep you, you know, if you got like an hour and a half, two hour wait, you got plenty to go around and look at and shop. And uh, when you're done eating, they even got a homemade ice cream shop there. All right, this is uh, the backside of the complex and the boardwalk where it uh, backs up to the bayou. You see here, all kinds of businesses and places to see. Yeah, this is a place where you actually wouldn't mind being on about an hour, an hour and a half wait. There's so many things to see and so many shops. You know, like this little trippy shop going down memory road trip. They even got an old beetle bug. Pretty cool. All right, the crowd's flowing in. We, we beat the crowd. We got here early. Anyway, I just want to kind of show you around the place. The place is huge. But this is one of the reasons why I come here, as you see, is this crispy, cool salad bar. We'll be getting to that in just a minute. So here we go, starting off with the crispy cool salad bar. You can actually add this on to a meal for $2.99. Right up my alley. The bacon bits and all the fixings. All right. You can see from the view from our table, you get the, the bayou in the background. It really adds to the atmosphere and uh, it's really picturesque. All right, so I got the whole flounder stuffed with crab meat dressing. I've already gotten into it a couple bites, but it comes with a hollandaise sauce. You know, if it wasn't quite fat enough, they add the hollandaise there with it. So let me go ahead and give this another try here. It's crab meat dressing. Mmm. That is excellent. And look at the flakiness of that flounder just pulls right apart mm. all right and of course it comes with hush puppies and a side and i added on that salad bar great hush puppies by the way all right be right back with the next item next on the list we've got the popcorn shrimp lunch uh special fish basket Look at that, lightly breaded. Go ahead and put it, and you get to make your own cocktail sauce, which you all know I love to make my own because I like it spicy. That is very good. Comes with creamy, cool coleslaw. Perfect. Not too sugary, not too sweet. Got a little taste of the vinegar in there. But, yeah, this is a really good shrimp here. Girls, what do y'all have here? Mackenzie, what do you get? I, I got fish, popcorn shrimp, and fries, and it's really, it's amazing. Oh, wow. That's great. Mary, right, what about you? Uh, I have popcorn shrimp, and it's very, 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 very good. Would you recommend to come back here summertime? Yeah, they give us free alligators. <laughs> I could have sworn I first It's just the alligators getting to you. Yeah. Everything was wonderful. I'm as full as a tick. I can hardly breathe. Uh, everything
everybody liked their food. It was great. And of course, the, we get to leave and say goodbye to the old alligator. Won't see him again until next year. Uh, as I said in the opening, this place is locally owned, so we get out and support our local places and write a passage. Got to get here. So with that said, y'all don't know nothing about this original oyster house. Now you know the facts of why I'm on a mission. You're always welcome back to Goodall's Country Kitchen.